Ukrainian authorities have imposed unprecedented travel restrictions on Russian citizens. All men aged between 16 and 60 traveling without families will now be denied entry to the country. Ukraine's border service says the ban aims to prevent, quote, healthy males from somehow influencing the situation in protest-ridden eastern regions. Russian experts predict the restrictions will have a negative impact on Ukraine's economy, even sparking revolt among the locals, especially in the east, where most people have family members with Russian citizenship. RT's Maria Fanoshna has this, re this report now from Donetsk. This is Donetsk International Airport. Uh, this is departure hall. As you can see, we only expect uh, flights to Kiev and Turkey's Istanbul, but every day there is at least one flight going from here to Moscow, and there is at least one or sometimes even two airplanes flying from Moscow to Donetsk. And now people are concerned and are worrying about what is going to happen with these flights and with the passengers of these flights. I arrived at Donetsk airport and was immediately stopped at the border and taken to a small room. They started asking me about my education, how much money I have. Then they told me I had to go back to Moscow. I myself am from Donetsk. My son lives there. My best friend's relatives missed his wedding because their age and physical condition are now suspicious to Ukrainian border control officers. If they find camo clothes or military boots in your luggage, they immediately think you're a Russian agent. And we're called separatists. We're peaceful protesters, much more peaceful than those who rallied at Maidan. We are against the treacherous actions of the Ukrainian authorities that ban people from seeing their loved ones. These two states have very close ties and of course these concerns uh, are very clear and very obvious. Ukrainians have many Russian relatives, Russians have many Ukrainian relatives and they travel a lot to visit each other. And of course they are now afraid that with these new restrictions from Ukraine's border control, they, uh, it will affect their relations with their families. Rafnoshna, RT from Donetsk in Ukraine.